hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to add a new value to an existing selection field in Odo. so currently if I go to the contacts menu and if I open an existing customer so I will just open this customer that is Azure interior and if I open and if I click on edit button you can see we have got a selection field here so as the debug mode is already opened in the DB and if I place the mouse over that field you can see the field technical name of the field is company underscore type and the type of the field is selection with two values that is person or individual so in the UI you can see we have got only two values in the field that is either individual or company so now let's take a case where we need to add a third value like individual company followed by xyz in that selection so we will discuss how to add that in an efficient way so for this case we have seen that people are what doing is that they have entirely copying the existing field and put it in the custom add ons for custom module and they are adding the values so that is not the better way so the better way is to do is that so this is the our custom module that is OAMP hospital which we are continuing the development so I'll just inherit the corresponding model that is you know the model of uh, the contacts is rs.partner you can see the from the URL so I have to inherit this model first so here in the patient.py so here we have the code of already what we have already inherited the sale order so I'll just copy this as a template and I will paste it here so I'll just paste it here and I'll just make the necessary changes like I'll change the class name I'll change the class name as sorry I have to update the class name first so I'll just update the class name as RS partner and inherit you have to give the model that you have to inherit that is RS partner so I have inherited the corresponding model in my custom module then you know you have to place mouse over here then you can see the field name is company type so you have to give the correct field type here else it will be a new field so I have given the company type here so if you then that's done so we have to add fields dot selection so as it is selection field fields dot selection then if you search inside the code that is I'm going to search inside the Odoo code that is for a key I'll just click on find in path and if I search for control a selection add selection underscore add so you can see an example here so I'll just copy this thing selection add and I will add it to my module so I'll just copy and I will paste it here selection underscore add so let's take a case we need to add a new value here that is Odoo mates as a third selection so I'll go to the PyCharm and in the selection I'll give the key as OM sorry I'll give the instead of base rule I'll give OM and as the label I'll give automates so what you have to do is that you have to just use selection underscore add and you have to define new value here so now we have done so let's restart the service as we have made changes inside the Python so you can see the service has got restarted now we will go to the UI and let's refresh the screen and see whether the whether new field has got added there or not so it's loading and if I click on edit mode you can see we are getting third value that is Odoo mates is coming here so earlier when we have checked we have got only two fields that is individual company now we have added Odoo mates suppose if you need to add one more so I'll just copy this thing Odoo mates and I'll paste it here itself that is let it be XYZ or Odoo dev Odoo dev I'll just add here update the level as Odoo dev we have to just restart the service okay the service has got restarted now let's refresh the UI to see the change so you can see the form is getting loaded so once the form is loaded you can just click on it button and you can see we have got four values right now that is individual company Odoo Mix and Odoo Dev and on placing the mouse over you can see different values person company OM and Odoo Dev so this is how you can inherit and add a new value to a selection field in Odoo there is no need to replace whole fields completely just use this selection add method so this is all about this video and if you have any queries or sessions or feedbacks please comment it out or you can directly reach us over the email odomates at gmail.com and please like the videos and subscribe to the channel thank you